Good day, good night, good evening, whatever it may be. It's time to talk with Lysium. And what I'm going to talk about today is something that's very dear to my heart. Something that's very important for young men these days. Something that's very important for anybody, for any man um, in particular, who, uh, who's not looking to have any children, make any accidental babies. Now, we've all wanted a pill before, a pill for men, you know. The male pill, which would, of course, stop sperm, you know, take all the bullets out of a gun, perhaps, and prevent pregnancy, 100%. Well, they haven't quite given us a pill yet, but there is hope. There seems to have been a new invention developed, a chip, uh, or a switch, actually. That could be uh, <laughs> inserted into uh, your body um, on the scrotum or near the scrotum, which could, with a you know, just like a light switch, turn it on. Your penis will, of course, uh, shoot out sperm when you come or ejaculate, whatever you call it, and you know, off switch where no sperm comes out, which would uh, be 100% effective in preventing um, you getting women pregnant. Now, I particularly think this is a great day for all mankind. I haven't um, used the chip myself, so I can't say if uh, the process of getting inserted into your body uh, feels bad. I don't know for sure if it's 100%. I believe it is 100%, but I haven't. I don't have any anecdotal evidence to support that as of now. But let's just assume that it does work. I think this is a a great thing for all men. I think that I think anybody anybody who doesn't want to have any children should get them get it put in. Now for anybody who's already married any man who's already married for whatever reason I, I wonder if it's ethical to insert this into his uh, body without his wife's knowledge and then you could uh, you know turn the switch off so he doesn't shout any sperm. I would say that's kind of unethical but you know I've seen uh, women um, have the birth control pill and not take them either. Then nobody's complained about it. So I guess maybe if a man did that, it wouldn't be such a big deal. I mean, just one man. I'm not saying men in general. Just one man. But, uh, <clears throat> yeah, that sounds like a good find, a good thing that's been done. And um, I think we need to give the uh, inventor credit. He deserves credit. I assume that it works. Even if, even if it's 90% effective, we still got to give the man or uh, woman credit, and they certainly deserve it. Uh, but how does everyone else feel? Is this a good thing? Is this a leap forward? And I got to say to those in MGTO and probably some MRAs, uh, this is a very, very good thing. A huge step forward. Now... I think uh, this will probably help with some population control <laughs> a little bit. I do believe that in the future there are going to be less children born. I mean, assuming this uh, thing doesn't cost a whole lot, because I haven't um, confirmed um, the cost of to actually buy the device and have it inserted into you. But once I do, I'll give you an update. Well, anyway.